Hey guys, it's Alvin here today. So just a little warning. I am downstairs, as you guys say, it's Tweety. Um, I am looking after Sammy. But this is the picture we are doing. It's electric by Diamond Hunt Club. So, yeah, I thought I'd do a little whipping chat and see how far we can get with his eyeball. <laughs> um, this paint is nearly there. It's nearly there. Um, yeah, so how is everyone? Hope everyone is well. I had a week off YouTube. Um, I literally just had um, a busy week. But now I am back. Doing what I love. So number eight is three oh seven and it is the dot. Not sure where so there's gonna be more of Tweety's face. But yeah, we've got a lot of unboxings coming. Um but yeah, I hope everyone's had a great week. Uh, Tuesday today. And it this heat is getting that bit now where I just don't like it. <laughs> um, in the UK, we've been having this unusual warm weather. I know it's summer. I know it's summer now, but <laughs> normally our summers here are rain. I know it's going to happen. It's waiting for the kids to go off. Once they, all the kids finish for um, some holidays, the bad weather's going to come. But yeah, it's just been a busy all week, last week. Um, I got some pre cuts done for Tree Thursday as a, a lot of stuff came in. But yeah, so this week we've got, um, we had Timu on yesterday. Today is going to be this week of chat. Tomorrow is Wednesday, so it might be, I might see if I can get another week of chat filmed. Then Thursday, Tree Thursday, Friday, God knows what that's gonna be. <laughs> but yes, I have not worked on this painting for a while. <laughs> Been doing different ones. I've got one a different one to go, which you guys have not seen the unboxing just yet. So I don't really that'll probably be going up on the Thursday, Tree Thursday. Just so then I've got well I just put out Tree Thursday for Thursday, then Friday get the first few filmed. Because it's nearly there that, with that one. But yeah, um, I do have a like, multiple starts. <laughs> but this one um, will get finished. The other starts I do have are going to be put on the bottom of the pile for now. Just so I can get a little bit more done. But yeah, um, as you guys see, I've literally got two of... Two of Who's left of Tweety and I am nearly there. <laughs> Here's my favourite Looney Tune. This is the old style of Tweety because Tweety's changed. Now he's got a bigger head and his eyelashes are longer. But I think this is the old style from Warner Brothers. Warner Brothers. Um, but yeah, everything. Sammy's been good. He's been healthy. Um, He's been really good. Nothing changed over the week. Um, it's just the weather. He hates the sun. And yeah, he's literally lying on the floor by the door. Because he just, for him, he, he's very, his face is black, so he's very dark colour. So every time the sun, the sun will directly hit him. And he hates it. He's, he's, um... Been good though. He's been like really cool. He's been re trying to keep him cool to the hard spot. But you know the night time in the UK. Why is it so muggy, so clammy? Why can't it just cool down? <laughs> That's the reason why I'm not enjoying the weather. Is I don't mind in the daytime. Don't get me wrong. Daytime can have the sun out, warm out, heat out. But night time is when it should start to cool down. It should cool down to a temperature where 
It's nice and cool. But it didn't, it didn't, well, we've had thunderstorms Friday night and last night. And it's straight after the thunder, it picked up again. The heat just picked all the way up again and say, are we going to get a break? <laughs> I don't know about the heat, but um, I just worry. So, as you guys know, Sammy's epileptic. Overstressing, overheating can cause a seizure of it. And the way this weather's been, I have tried everything to keep it cool. Um, a couple of a couple of nights it's been reasonably where he'll just fall asleep, and then he wakes up thingy. But it's just been so hot, and. I panic and I worry over Sammy and the cats to get around the cats um they were cool the cats actually they've spread out when I got them their paws and their noses because they've got to have wet noses so then you know they're okay but when I felt the noses and I felt the pads their paws they were cold so but for the life of me I cannot remember where the cats have a where their thing is at you know a dog's pants I just don't have a clue where the cats do it and I think it's the pads I'm sure it's the pads that do it but you know you th can't remember but yes they're nice and cold Sam was a bit warm because he was panting but yeah he was really good really slept well um, the noises you hear them is saying, and um, I thought he was going to bark because we had people walk past the house, but he's been a good boy today. But yeah, this heat is just thingy. I always thought after thunderstorms it should cool down. You should get that nice cold weather. And then for the past three nights, we've got baby seagulls on the roofs. Again, we do love to do it on the chili pots, that's where they nest. And uh, quarter past two, I'll say, on Saturday night, on Monday night, Sunday night, sorry, they start squeaking. And it's every time we've had a bit of rain, they kick off. So I think what's happening is with the rain, they move the babies down from the chimney pots to the roof to get them safe. But I don't know if, it's, if, it's, if that's what they do, because the next minute they score on the heck, they are shouting each other. Um, I always thought seagulls slept at night. Um, I always thought that they kept quiet during the night because they were asleep. But yeah, but when I, because I like something before I go to bed, and I looked up to the roof where the seagulls were, and in the dark, I see something. It looked like there's something at the edge of the roof. I was like, is that my eyesight, or is that something actually watching me with Sammy? And I was looking at it, but you know, it's like dark and you can't really work out if it's a thing, it's a flower. It could have been just a flower sitting there or a tree. But it was right close to the edge of the roof. I thought, if that falls and that's a baby, whoever's got a cat or a dog will have that. And I was thinking that. But um, I checked this morning and whatever it was, it seems to be gone. So I'm thinking it could be what they've been doing with the rain because we've been out for under lightning is the mother is bringing them down to a safer height and then the shuttle bought to come back <laughs> once it's all over and done with but um, yeah they are really they're very quiet during the day and then the quarter past two in the morning they just start just squeaking their little heads off but these are baby seagulls here a little grey fluffy things and they are cool, so cute but it's cool past two in the morning why are they squawking <laughs> but yeah everyone's been good just been dealing with the heat Sammy's just as I say he doesn't like the sun so he's trying his best ever saying um, ice cubes to give but if you give ice cubes just a little one, just be careful because um, 
Ice cubes can break down at temperature super fast. So, so just like get that little thing up. They are allowed fr fruit, juice, lollies, ice pops, um, made of fr real fruit juice. Dogs, I don't know, cause let me, they took an ice pop off me the other day. But um, dogs are allowed that. Anything natural, um, cold ice cubes, you can do ice pops. Cool mats, just make sure everything's cool for them. With our cats, I. It's not too easy, but no. With our cats, our cats don't tell us the heart. I am. Um, they don't pant. Just get this cool. They don't pant and they don't make them sound like they're hot. So, uh, what I do is I get the water. As they don't take the water out the bowl, what I do is I rub it on the noses. So then I know they've, they've licked it off the nose and they've had a drink. Snowy is asleep. Smudge is probably asleep upstairs while she's looking out the window. It's one day. <laughs> uh, Smudge is a tabby. She is absolutely terrified to come down because um, she's not a big fan of Sammy. Um, she sleeps with him when he's in the cage, but um, Sammy has this thingy where he has to get up when she comes into the plane and run out. <laughs> um, we told him to stop it. Snowy will stand his ground. You see, he will smack him if he gets on his nerves. He will give him a smack like a pat on the ears. So like leave me alone, but Smudgy's just a little bit scared, so she's she'll stay upstairs at the way. Night time when she comes to me, Sam is in his cage, and there's a reason why he, he's in that is one, it's his safety and the cat safety, and if he ever goes, he's had a fit to fit in there, and it's the safest place for him. But yeah, I hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone is. Having fun, um, down painting and that. I have not worked on Tweety for a little bit, and that is just due to working on a new canvas. And plus, when I say Tweety by upstairs, he's more harder to work on because he's a larger canvas, so he bends on my fold out table. But otherwise than that, it's just great to be working on them again. I prefer this one downstairs working on them. But also, um, do you know, like, when no one's in the house, so if it's only me, Sam and Snow. Then I can work on them on Tootie because I seem to get a lot more done. But yeah, so nothing really interesting has happened over the week. Um, I said that I have been filming some unboxings and yeah, I the Whipper Chats will be coming back to the channel. It's just. I don't have a have a lot to talk about as as um you guys know I stay in with Sam most of the time. Cut that down, I need to but yeah, I stay in with Sam. My mum has had knee problems so I've been getting out helping, that's another reason why some videos are not uh, recorded as well but she's gone out today because she feels a bit more better a bit more stronger so she's gone out today plus we've got some as well tonight which is like weight watches but yeah we're losing weight so we've got to go there but yeah um absolutely nice if i can get a bit more of this done tonight <clears throat> but yeah if you like the canvas, by the way, and down below when I put this up, 
I do have a um, link with Diamond Arco for first time buyers. So feel free to use it if you want to. I do make a small commission. Um, that commission will go straight back to the channel. But yeah, I'm going to leave this here. Um, just a little bit of just sitting back. And yeah, so I'll leave a link to the cameras down below. Um, and yeah, I'll do it for down below Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, my Twitch is down below. Or Dr. Philly, if you want to buy. So down below, I've got TikTok, Instagram, Facebook group. I've also got a Twitch because I sometimes I am a gamer and I do stream sometimes. Um, I also have down below as well my affiliate codes with Diamond Art Club and R Dot, which I need to do more videos with that case. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll leave a link down below to this cameras. As I said, this is the whole picture. It's electric. So I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.